Alright, welcome back everyone to the TechZone tutorial. Uh, we're going to continue our FPS tutorial in Unity 3D. And one of my subscribers asked me how you add health to our game. And, uh, well, that's about it. Um, yeah, it's really easy to do. There's a built-in script ready made, and I'm going to show you how to enable it. And it will also help you to add a heads-up display to your game as well. Okay, so um, let's begin. First of all, select the first person controller. Go to Component, Scripts, it's an easier way of adding scripts, and go to FPS Player. We're going to add that script, and you will get this preferences at the bottom. Now, Hit Points has already been set for you, uh, but you cannot play the game unless you uh, fill in the variables of Bullet GUI, Rocket G GUI, and Health GUI, which are the heads of display. Okay, so let's fill them up. Bullet GUI. We go to, uh, it should be a GUI text as it says here. So we go to game object, create other GUI text. So let's move this a bit. Let's just drag this X position so that we can move it. Okay, let's move this down. Okay, first of all, let's rename this to bullet. And the text over here in the preferences will be called bullet. So if you can see here. And then I'm going to duplicate this. Just further away from it. And that one is going to be our ammo. So I'll just rename the text to ammo. Then we'll go to first person controller. Fill in the bullet GUI variable by selecting um, okay this is rather confusing let me just check okay let's rename this to ammo left easy as that now let's fill in that again ammo left so now this ammo ammo thing will be the number of ammo you have left on the machine gun which we which will be a number of course okay so now let's add a rocket GUI which is how many rockets you have so create other GUI texture and let's move this to the side move this down that should do it and we're gonna set the texture to none but don't worry we're gonna do something uh, we're gonna just go down to weapon scripts and drag the draw rocket script into this Unity watermark small object. Okay? And the rocket texture will be GUI Rocket 21. Uh, okay, you know what? It was there. The position was wrong for the draw ro rocket script. Uh, position wise should be 68 so that we can notice it. And now we can change it as freely as we want. Now I want it to be on the right side. And right about there. Okay, so let's continue by going to first person controller. Uh, Rocket GUI, let's fill that up with uh, Unity, Unity watermark small. And let's fill in the hell GUI. Let's go to bullet, let's duplicate that, and let's bring it a little down. Whoops. Like there. Except we'll change the text to help. And this one was also changed to help, so we can easily find it. This time we're gonna add another GUI texture. And let's move this down. Smooth this a little there. And texture will be the health bar. Now I'm going to reduce the height because I want it to be a narrow health bar. But the width will be quite long. And let's increase the y axis of the position. Let's move it over there. Ah. Okay, that should do it. Uh, color, I'll change it to a little bit red. 
then go to first person controller um held UI and here we go again okay let's change that to help bar let's get a first person controller fill in the help UI variable to help bar now here is the problem uh, since we were editing on a small preview it won't uh, stick in that place on the full preview if you can see the positions aren't really the same so it's kinda really difficult when you uh, want to put uh, GUIs or the heads up display in the right place but since this is a tutorial I'm not gonna waste my time doing that okay so let's show off the bullets so if you can see the bullet number if you can see over there 38 if I shoot the bullets go down and once it goes to zero it reloads and you can go on not so realistic reload at all health watch this this is crazy I shoot the ground it shoots myself and the health bar goes down once it goes to zero there's your answer it fades out fades in again back to where you're supposed to start and finally the rocket GUI press 2 to switch the rocket let's just shoot watch the watch the rocket GUI as I shoot the rocket numbers go down but watch what happens when I finish them let's just keep going shoot as much as I want and on one more left no we can't shoot anymore because the rocket ammo had just finished so pretty much it's crap right now so uh... it's a worthless weapon once we finish it off but still we're done with the rocket launcher and we're done with the GUI stuff and uh... yeah that's about it hope you enjoyed the tutorial if you did want to subscribe for more so uh, next time, I'll show you how to, um, hmm. hmm, that's one thing I gotta make out of. Look, I'll just think of something, and I'll make a tutorial on it. So, thanks for watching, and have a great day.